I made a Darth Vader version of this, but here is some things about Boba Fett's suit. So Boba Fett's suit is Mandalorian armor. Though Fett himself is not a Mandalorian by birthright, he doesn't call any world in the Mandalorian system home. He wears a suit of battered armor in the style of the ancient warrior race. For centuries, the Mandalorians pillaged the galaxy, beginning with planets around them in the Outer Rim, advancing further inward through violent force and military conquest. Most of them were wiped out in conflicts with the Jedi Order dispatched by the Old Republic to surtail their raiding parties from nearby star systems. Boba Fett's armour, though heavily scarred, is able to withstand brutal attacks due to the Mandalorian craftsmanship. Okay, this is a well-known one, but it comes with a jetpack, more than just a simple jetpack. However, Boba Fett's highly useful backpack is both a jumper pack and a rocket launcher, giving him two useful components in one. The jumper pack contains a grappling hook projectile that can be attached to the rocket launcher if he needs to climb or repel, as well as the other tracking device and food rations. It also carries a jet jumper system that allows Fett to have limited flight time in the air with sustainable rocket blasts or to make his own ambush of a bounty. Okay, this is quite a cool one. All of his gadgets are triggered by voice command. Boba Fett is nothing if not prepared. As good as any bounty hunter worth his asking price knows, the right tactical gear on a mission makes all the difference between bringing in a bounty and rarely escaping with your life. But even the best gear and gadgetry is no good to a bounty hunter if they can't access it all at the right moment. That is why Fett has voice command in his helmet. Through the comm system, he can launch a missile from his jetpack or shoot darts from the armor plate on his kneecaps. This comes in especially handy when he needs his hands free to fire blasts or rifles or bring in his prey. It stands to reason that the best bounty hunter in the galaxy is the one who could successfully track their prey or their enemies to the furthest reaches of the galaxy. To secure his title, Boba Fett carries numerous tracking devices that prevent his mark from eluding him no matter if they're in the middle of Coruscant or unknown territories. From using an iron limpet to a homing beacon to track spacecraft across the galaxy, Okay, his shin pockets are lifted with anti-security blades. There's just about nowhere on Boba Fett's suit that isn't lethal enough to make him one giant walking booby trap. The anti-security blades kept his shin pockets, allowing him to vanquish fence field and dampen security cameras and their connected alarm system via intense harmonic interference. When he sets them higher, Fett's sophisticated electric instruments can erase magnetic locks, granting him access to nearly any type of door. Though Fett usually likes to retrieve his marks without drawing a lot of attention, occasionally he has to resort to more dangerous methods. That's why he's always prepared to blow something up and keeps gadgets on him at all times. When Fett isn't firing a missile or his blaster rifle to disintegrate his prey, he's getting up close and personal. His suit features all kinds of lethal weapons to hand-to-hand -to -hand combat, from spring-loaded boot spikes to knee pad rocket dart launchers, and he's got what it takes. In secret compartments through his suit, he has sonic beam weapons that emit a screaming noise along with high-intensity blade of energy, as well as alloy blades capable of slicing you with ease. Finally, Boba Fett's suit works in all environments, from Cloud City to Jabba's palace on Tatooine, Boba Fett has to be ready to enter any environment. That's why the environmental controls in his helmet are essential for his survival, filtering toxins and giving him up to two hours of clean oxygen. His reinforced double-layered flight suit beneath his Mandalorian armor is also suitable for an extremely cold deep space. Other crucial elements include his target rangefinder. He can track up to 30 targets at one time on the left side of his helmet and an internal web of sensory equipment located inside it. Boba Fett is one of the best characters. His show was a bit of a letdown, but he is very, very much a fan favourite.